cancelled a flight on his travel plans. It seems our wizard couldn't fly without a passport. This morning, the wizard was unpacking. His triumphant return to Australia ruined. Instead of a passport, the wizard was to have travelled on this special document. But the Australian immigration minister wasn't impressed. It's a technicality. It's a nitpicking bureaucratic obfuscation, basically. The British-born wizard has been trapped in New Zealand for 10 years since he gave up his official documents and became a living work of art. When the Australians turned down his latest application, all seemed lost. But high-level negotiations between immigration consultants and the governments of New Zealand, Britain and Australia today found a solution. Now armed with a British oh, document yes, as yes. well as custom-made New Zealand travel papers, the Australians will finally let the wizard in. Tonight, the wizard's repacking, rebooking his flights and getting ready for a spell in Oz. Raywin Rash, 3 National News.